Would a person want to go through life missing a finger or a toe? No. Would a person want to miss a leg and, ha and have an amputation? Never. Well, a person has to know that when he does mitzvot, this makes hashpa on his guf and his neshama. In the Olam MS, people will be able to look at a person and tell what was he shalim in and what was he not shalim in. If they see a person who's blind or maybe he's missing one eye, it's a tremendous humiliation forever and ever. Why? Because in that area he was lacking. So a person has to care about himself, care about his future. No one wants to be chas shalom, handicapped or, or a nebuch. And I'll just give you a marshal. Imagine someone's a New York Giants fan. He's always walking around with his New York Giants ha cap. Well, people, one second, half, this is what the guy's about. He loves baseball. In the Ulama MS, it'll be nick right away. What does this person love? How fortunate will a person be that his friends, his relatives, Klai Yisrael, will look at him and say, wow, this is a person who loved Tyra Mitzvah. And Chas Shom, it shouldn't be a bush of a person that he sees that, ah, oh, look at that. He's missing a hand because he never gave staka. He's missing a foot because he never went to the Beis Medrash to learn. Ay, he's missing an ear because he always listened to Lashonara. Ay, Nebuch, he can't talk because uh, he used to say Onas Devarim and insult his wife. And the Chavetz Chaim said it's the same thing with Malachim. A person who makes a bracha well, he makes a beautiful Malach. If he mumbles the bracha, he makes a crippled Malach. Our our mitzvahs, our maestim, our thoughts, our words, our actions are actually being bina alamais. So how careful a person should be to guard his thoughts and, and to guard his actions because one day it'll be the most beautiful or most horrible video that he's ever going to have to watch. Thank you for listening to the Guard Your Eyes Daily Chizuk Broadcast. Pass them on to your friends and help spread Kedusha in the world.